Hello to the best community on YouTube. I may be pretty biased, but it's very true. You are absolutely amazing and I'm absolutely here for every single one of you. Welcome. That was a very long intro. Welcome to Let's Build. And welcome to part four of Red Rock Bend. We're going to be getting some more interior work done today. Probably going to do the living area, maybe the entrance hall, and maybe a bedroom as well. See how much we can get done. I think two rooms is suffice for one part. And then what I'll do is bring the final part out next week. Um, maybe Monday, maybe not. I might feel a bit creative on Monday, do something different, but it will be out next week. So very exciting, very exciting indeed. Um, anything that I need to say? No. No, I don't think there is, actually. I've got an idea for something. Um, I'm going to do a community post about it. And I'm, I'll speak about it now. Why not? Um, I really want to do, like, a kind of renovation sort of series with your guys' builds. Like Kayla, Little Simsy does with her Fixer Opera um, sort of, like, series. I really like that idea. So I'm going to think of a hashtag. I haven't thought of one yet. And on the gallery, what I want you guys to do is build me a build that you want me to kind of fix up. And I'd love you to kind of put a backstory behind the build. And also, I would love like um, like a limit, like a kind of simoleon amount you want me to spend to fix this house up and what you want me to do to it. So I'll do a community post sometime, maybe this weekend and put that out there for next week. And I'll bring the first part out next week and I'll find a build that I really, really want to give a renovation. And we'll go from there. I thought that's a great idea. I thought I'd just kind of skim over that subject now. And then at a later date, we'll go on a bit more with that. But I thought that was a really fun idea. So love Kayla's series. So thank you, Kayla, for the idea. Very nice. Um, but yes, anyway, let's get into game and let's start building. So here we are, my absolute bitches. We are back at Red Rock Bend. Um, not nothing much changed from last time. Uh, I think the only thing I did was move the dishwasher over near the sink and put the microwave near the fridge as well. I just thought the layout works a bit better that way. So I did that. Um, I still haven't got around to answering all of the comments yet either, but I will get to that. I've already, I've caught up with most of the other videos now. So I've read all the comments and answered where I can. And I'll get to these ones probably when this one is rendering. So this that sentence will probably make no use to you because I would have answered by now. But yeah, I liked I liked this kitchen, like how it looked, like the courtyard as well. It's all going spiffingly. Now I think um this is gonna be the living area here. This is one bedroom, two bedroom over here with an ensuite, and the master bedroom. So we'll probably concentrate on the master suite today. Um, because they've got their own ensuite there too. And yes, I think we'll go down that route, darlings. So, do I want blinds is the question. And will any of these blinds look awful? I kind of do want blinds. These are quite nice, actually. Let me just see what they look like when I group them all up together, though. Oh, I quite like it. But it's just taking away all of that view out to me. Like, that there would just be amazing. It does need some kind of privacy thing up there. So maybe what I could do is use the these oh, oh i think we can oh have we got a no <laughs> but i said we got a better swatch for this room but we haven't i think that's the best oh that one was okay the pale one i kind of prefer that one with this room and we can just pretend they pretend we can just pretend they can drop these down at any given opportunity to um give their room an extra bit of privacy but yeah, I like that. You can see I've used these lights all through it as well. I do like those lights. I do. Um, what are they? Where are they from again? I never know where these lights are from. They're from Eco Living or Eco Lifestyle. I would never not call it Eco Living. Uh, what can I say? What can I say? You know. Now, do we want a fireplace? Would a fireplace make sense in a place like this? <sighs> Maybe a wood burner. Maybe a wood burner. I have put some like. Um, I'll move these. I'll move them over here because this is where we're going to be placing the chimney or the fireplace. Yeah. Do you know what we're going to do? Oh, 
I've just had a thought, darlings. Oh, what about if I diagonally do this? I think I'm going to be here for this. Spoiler. But I do think I'm going to be here for this. And then putting in a cheeky little wood burner on this bit. Diagonally into the room in copper. Oh, I think I'm here for it. Because these environments do get cold at night. Like desert landscapes do get cold at night. So it kind of makes sense. So I'm kind of going to go for that instead. Now let's move you over to this way. We don't need two, but I just think these look better when there's two of them for some reason. Don't know why. And I'm not even sure they're chimneys. What are they? Vents. They're vents, but we're using it as a chimney. Um, and you can't stop me. You cannot stop me. So yeah, we'll go for that. We'll go for that there. They would have a TV. I would imagine Karen loves to keep up to date with her soaps. And you can imagine she loves drama. Drama everywhere she goes. Everywhere she goes is Karen. Now, should we use a different TV in here? I wish we had some more. I'm bored of all the bloody TVs. They're all either too big or they're too um, ugly. <laughs> so, uh, do you know what? I think I'll go for this one. It's a bit more of a default option, isn't it? Um, and I'll go for it in a silver as well. I might go for a slightly lighter aesthetic in here. Maybe trying to tie in the lightest part of this wood. But um, who can say? We're going to see what happens. I think one thing that would suit this room would be that. That would suit this room. Oh, it does, you know. And now I've used that colour in here. I kind of like it. But let me just see with a lighter aesthetic. Oh, no. I think we'll go for a lighter. A lighter aesthetic. And I could have got the one that sits on top of here. But I'm just going to go for the wall one. Doesn't matter too much. Doesn't matter too much at all. Um, That's a good spot. But I would love to flop in a bookcase. Now, can we get a decent skinny bookcase that would suit the style of this room? My all sources point to no. But I'm going to give it a good old bash and see what we come up with. Uh, let me have a look. Do you know what? The one from um, Realm of Magic looks quite nice in here. I think the colours tie in well. And it's got that little bit of detail on the front that we can just... I don't know. I like that. I like that. I will, however, just shuffle this just slightly. Just slightly along. Slightly along to there. And it's quite a nice size room as well. So I may even... Um, Karen's a manager. She is. So I may even give her her own like PC and like desk in here. Maybe looking out again, she loves to nose out at the neighbours. So maybe I could put like a nice desk here. So maybe I'll do that first before I choose the uh, sofas and stuff. Just so I can kind of get bearings of the, um, the size and what we would need for in here. I think two sofas would probably be good o okay in here. Or a three-seater with... Um, a three-seater with a chair, like an armchair. Uh, I don't think we're going to get a matching one with this. But again, we're not trying to match in the woods too much with this lot. But I just thought that style would have suited this then. I was wrong. I was. I was wrong. Well, the style suited it. The wood tones were just not the one. Oh, sorry. My phone's blinging off. What is that? That's like an emergency update. No. <sighs> I hate seeing like breaking news come through on my phone. Sorry about that. I always have to check just in case. You never know. I'm, you never bloody know. Oh, or should we go... Uh, that's too classic for in here. It's too classic. I mean, contemporary, not classic. I need classic for in here. It needs to be a bit more ornate. So I'm going to find one. This one from Seasons, I think. I think that wood tone ties in quite well with the darker points of the wood tone. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I love the way I'm like, not worrying about wood tones. And then I'm all like, let's tie them in. The Sims. It is The Sims. I went on a bit of a spending spree today, loves. Won't lie to you. Went on a bit of a spending spree for Christmas. Get some Christmas presents sorted. I've decided this year to get all of my Christmas presents from like independent retailers, like on Etsy and all of that kind of business. Um, just because I think Amazon are gonna swamp Christmas for a lot of people this year, and I don't want to give Jeff Bezos any more money than what he's got already. To be honest. Uh, even though, don't get me wrong, I do love using Amazon. Absolutely do. But I try to kind of like mix it up a bit. Is anybody else like that out there? I'd be interested to know what you guys are doing that kind of wise for Christmas with your buying and whatnot. I really would. I'm going to go for this chair. Different colour wood. But the blue ties in nicely with the little like hints of blue on the um, curtains and stuff. And I think I'm going to use a blue sofa in here as well. Um, 
Oh God, this is just making me fume, making me fume. But we've got to see past this. We've got to see past the unmatching woods because this is just real life. It's just real life. I'm trying to make this realistic, really. Now, sofa wise, I think I may have to go off camera and try and find a really decent sofa that's going to work well in here. I think we're going to go for these ones, these seats from the tiny living stuff pack. I like them. I like them. They're a little bit contemporary. But I do like that. I think this is a very Karen couch. I went through an awful lot of sofas then to find this one that I thought matched in quite well with Karen's personality. Plain and boring. <laughs> I'm shading Karen to the max, but she deserves it. She's a bitch. <laughs> anyway, rude for a star, Aiden. Disgusting. Stop being so mean to Karen. But I think mean people deserve to be mean to get to... You know where I'm going with that. I can't get that sentence out. <laughs> I can't get that sentence out. And I think hitting in a bit of this wicker in here, I really wish that this came in some different swatches. That's nice. I like that. Not in the right position, but I do like it. Um, maybe I could just put it off to the side here like that. That's better. That's lending a bit of the Mexican influence that I'm trying to get in um, because of Raphael. Little hints of him here and there, but Karen has taken over and Raphael was just like, do you know what? Decorate however the hell you want to decorate. He cannot be dealing with the arguments. He really can't. He's absolutely fuming about it, to be honest. He told me. He told me. <laughs> it's so funny as well to see how many of you are thirsting over him. I can't help it. I have to make fit dads. Fit daddies. It's just my prerogative, you know? You know. Um, Table-wise, nothing big is going to be able to fit in here. This would be okay, this kind of size. So maybe I could go down that route. But do we want to make the table a little bit more modern? Or should we just go for classic table? I'm going to go for this base game one. Yeah, I'm going to go for this base game one. I think this is tying in well to the bookcase and stuff. Yeah, yeah, I'm here for that. I kind of am. Really do want to center this over here. So I think I might do that as well. Yeah, we'll center that over the coffee table. Um, another thing I have to do in The Sims. Is my light in my living room centered over the coffee table? I think it kind of is, but I'm not sure. And then what I'm going to do is bring these um, base game uh, wall lights in. Oh, like, these have had a resurgence with me lately. I really, really enjoyed them. I just wish they came in some more swatches. I wish they came in some, like different swatches but I do love them I love them they come in enough neutral tones so you can use them a lot of places but I just love them I'd have them in my own house so that's always a winner always a winner my loves now I'm worried I'm, I am worried they won't be able to get to that bookcase so I may just shuffle everything backwards one wondering if I could put the desk over this side instead but it kind of defeats the object because I want Karen to be nosy I'm going to play a test it. I'll play a test this. But I'm hoping she should. They or they should be able to get through there. Uh, I don't think they're going to be able to looking at it now. But I need the space in front of that bookcase. I really do. So I'm going to put the bookcase a bit more there as well. We should be able to. Should be in the operative word. Hmm. Unless I spin this around. That could be a thing as well. I mean, she could still be nosy there because she could just turn her back and peek through the curtains. I love the way we're positioning furniture just so Karen could be nosy to the neighbours. <laughs> I'm for it. I really am. Yeah. No, I like that. Yeah, that's fine. That will work better, actually. She can watch TV and she can also be nosy. Okay. Right. Here... I would see a sideboard being there, just a thin console table. So we'll find one of them in a minute. And maybe a lovely plant in the corner. Quite a leafy green number here. Maybe that base game one that I used to death because arguably this is the best plant in the game. Apart from, actually, I'm going to take that back because it's not. Because the swatches underneath on the plant pot are very limiting. I would love to see just some like plain terracotta pots with this plant in. I know I can get custom content with that, but in game, you know, and plus the lighting is shit on it as well, which um, is um, the Sims all over, to be honest, the Sims. Do you know one thing that I will never understand is how they have not to this day fixed lighting on stairs. 
like the lighting on just stairs in general. Stairs in The Sims 4 can like absolutely, utterly and completely do one. <laughs> they really can. Do we want to get a hint more blue in here? Because we haven't got much blue going on. That looks pretty. That looks pretty with the wall. I like that. Yeah, we're going to do it. And I'm going to put a nice mirror above this as well. Don't know what kind of mirror though. I think we're going to use this contemporary looking one from uh, Snowy Escape. I like it. I think it fits the room quite nicely. And for the reason of, I really wanted to use, where are you? Where I wanted to use this one, but look how high it is. Like what, at what point did people put their mirrors up that high and you can't move it down? Oh, I zoomed in then. <laughs> but yeah, fuming. Absolutely fuming. I think I'll put a nice little one of these bad boys up here. Oh God, swatch, swatches, swatches. Uh, oh, it might have to be you instead. Yeah, we'll do that one instead. A little clock, maybe some ornaments. I'm, I would imagine Karen would be all... Oh, she would be a China cats. She would have China cats. Raphael's allergic to cats, by the way. Um, I've decided that. So she's never allowed to get a cat. So she's absolutely fuming about it. That's why she got a small dog. Yeah, I would. I would say that. Definitely. I would say pumpkin is definitely Karen's cat. Um, dog. <laughs> Not cat. That's a chicken, Aiden. That's not a cat. <laughs> Let me find a cat. There we go. Stunning. <laughs> Questionable, but it's Karen. What can I say? She likes pussy. Aiden. For goodness, enough of that. Thank you. Yes, I like this. I will. I'm going to central this even more now. Just because... I think it will just lend itself well, being kind of directly central to that. I know this is offset slightly, but it's the shape of the living room. We can't do anything about it. Um, do I want a side table there or do I want a lamp? I think I'm going to do a side table with a lamp on top. Um, oh, oh, if you commit a good swatch, you might work in here. Oh, oh, that's not too... Uh, um, no, no, not that one. Maybe you? Do you come in a decent enough spot? Oh, yeah, this one. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm going to turn it that way. Just because it's got a draw on that side. So just in case they, they're not going to be able to get behind there anyway. But pretend that they can. And then they can open the drawer. Maybe they've got magazines or stuff in there. I don't know. I do not know what they've got. I know we're filtered to cats and dogs here. But I just want to see if I can put anything in. Oh, would she have a Tiffany lamp? <sighs> no, it's too dark. It's too dark. But that would be Karen. It really would. We're going to go for that lamp from Seasons. And I've used a bit of a darker tone on it just to tie in with the lights up there. Um, yeah, I'm kind of for that. And I think here, do you know what would go here? This might be weird to a few people, but I think a bowl of fruit. A bowl of fruit. Not you. I want the base game one, really. Um, yeah, this one. Bowl of fruit. There we go. Oh, yes. And then a, I'm going to put a laptop here just in case she wants to go and be nosy in a coffee shop. That would be a Karen thing to do. There we go. How much money have we got here? We've got a lot of money. It's fine. So yeah, laptop. Another little desk lamp here as well. Um, yeah, like this. But in a white, stunning. And then what I'm going to do on the side here is put a little a little photo up. And that's all the Karens. They, that is all the Karens in the photo. Um, they don't play sport or anything. They just... Um, they just are, to be honest. I can't even finish that sentence. <laughs> yeah, no, this is looking good. This is looking good. Just getting another hint of blue in there as well. Just to really push it forward. I'm wondering whether to change this to that, like, goldy one. Oh, that's better. Yeah, I prefer that one. Yeah, no, that 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 is Karen's. That is Karen's and Raphael's room, without a doubt. Living room. Okay. I think what we'll go and do now, I'm going to start, I'm going to do a little entrance moment here. Cool. So I've pulled out this one from Cats and Dogs. Are you from Cats and Dogs? Where are you from? Laundry Day. Laundry Day and this object here as well, which is, oh, look at the size of it. It's bloody massive, that is. It's too big. That's what she said. Shut up, Aiden. Stop being filth, for goodness. Um, Yeah, we'll go for a bit of a darker wood there as well. 
Maybe I could put that over in that corner instead of there, because that's kind of in the way of the door. Yeah, we'll do it here. Oh, that's all up in my face then. Um, I'll put you like there. Cool. Little place to store their coats and stuff. And maybe just like I put a um, thermostat in to fit some air con. I would imagine this place would have air conditioning. It's got an air con unit above. So we're going to go for that. Excuse me. Little burp there. Inside one. Um, And a little... Well, well not... Oh. Oh my God. Aiden, stop it. For goodness. Maybe like a cat rug. Karen would, like, really, just as soon as Raphael comes home from work, cat, you know? <laughs> Such a Karen thing to do. It really is. Really is. And then a little bench moment here. Maybe this one. Oh, that colour goes quite well as well. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. And then I'm feeling another mirror behind here. And I think I'll use the... um This one. The eco living mirror behind there in that colour as well. Yeah. You know, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. No, I think that is what I wanted. That is, I might just do a little coaty peg up on the wall here. Um, I can never find this bastard, so give me one second. Found it. Just that one up there. Just by the door. I think that's a nice spot for it. Not going to do an umbrella stand or anything. Um, and I was going to put a plant here, but I don't... I kind of like that being open there. The archway. So I think I'll leave it. So yeah, nice little entrance hall. Sticking with the same theme of the colours in the living room, really. But I'm kind of here for that. I think we'll do the same with their master suite as well, which we're going to start now, my loves. So this is going to be a bit of an awkward layout, I think, because they've got an access point here, which I could change. I could put it down here, to be honest, to give us some more room. Um, And they've also got access out into the garden. So they do have to go through the... Oh, God, I didn't get rid of this i was supposed to get rid of these um so they have got access where they can come out through here but they have to walk through their courtyard to get into their bedroom but i quite like that quite like that idea um i'm not going to do any curtains in here no curtains in here maybe some on this window maybe a little blind on that window yeah a little blind on this window and um but none on that big face and window because they've got that kind of looking through that view there, which is really pretty, actually. I do like that. I do. I love it. Do we want to use you in here? Maybe. Yeah, we'll, we might use that one. I think this is where the bed's going to go as well. Um, I don't know what bed to use yet, though. I'm unsure. Unsure. I think we're going to go for this one and this swatch. I'll just cycle through the swatches. I think a little bit of brightness in here. Yeah, I kind of like that. I mean, I wouldn't have that IRL. But I think it suits this room. Yes, we'll do that one. This one's from Island Living, by the way, if you're wondering where that bed was from. It's a nice bed. Um, comes in a couple of neutral swatches. Um, <laughs> that one. Just one. <laughs> comes in a neutral swatch. <laughs> uh, right. Um... And wardrobe. Oh, God, this is going to be the killer. I think we'll have to put a wardrobe here. Let's get this grid on. No side table and just one side table off the side here. Or maybe a chest of drawers and no side tables at all. I could do that. Um, wardrobe wise. Oh, um, did we get any island living? Oh, we did. We got a dresser, didn't we, from island living? Will that work in here? Let me get that grid off so I can see these colors. I mean, it needs to be a little bit paler. I don't like it. I don't like it. I know like it. What about this? I've been using this to death recently because I just think it's the best wardrobe in the game at the minute. Um. Oh, I kind of like that. That brown sits on well with the brown on the duvet and at the headboard. So it's a little bit of a darker brown. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Yeah, so wardrobe there. Nice. Um, I would imagine, imagine a chair being there. I'm just going to have a drink. One second. Ah, there we go. Quenched. Absolutely quenched I am now. So yeah, just a nice armchair here. Just where I would imagine 
they would put their pants on or something. <laughs> pants or socks, whatever, you know. I mean, that chair would work in here. It was just wondering if we got a good swatch. That one kind of works. And so does that one. It definitely needs to be a darker wood. Oh, that one's nice. Let me see if I can find... Oh, that one's even better. Yeah, that's the chair. We'll plop you into the corner. I would imagine Raphael loves this chair. It's not so much a Karen chair, but... You know what? It's compromised sometimes, and it's hard to compromise with, with a Karen. We've all learnt this. <laughs> we really have. I think a couple of plants down on the floor here. Maybe the terracotta numbers just right by the window would look really pretty. I kind of like that for us. And maybe one of these as well in the darker... The darker tone. Oh, where, am I, where have I gone? In fact, with the terracotta. Don't like the way the... Oh, no, that one's better. I hate that the green changes when you change these swatches. Like the green on the tree, the actual plant itself changes. I wish it just stayed that colour there. And then I would be very happy. It is complaining with Aiden today. But I think sometimes, especially when a game is so expensive. And things don't work the way that you want them to. You should complain about it. And that is what I'm here for you to do. <laughs> oh, Christ on a bicycle. Um, Definitely not you. Maybe a makeup station for Karen? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I do believe. And this one here. Should we do this in a dark? Oh, that's too dark. Oh, no. We're not going to get a matching tone in here. Oh, God. Oh, Christ. Oh, maybe not. No, no matching wood tones. And to be honest with you, it probably won't fit there very well. Um, I just tried a few orientations of it then and it wasn't working. So maybe this chest of jaws would work well in here. Um, this is from base game, by the way. It's really nice chest of jaws, this. I just wish it didn't have that, like, runner across the top of it. I wish it was just a plain draw set. I'd be much happier about that. Um, I kind of okay with that one it's not the perfect wood tone mix but we're gonna use it anyway and i liked you where you were Can, i haven't even got a quarter tile placement on for goodness sake hayden sort your shit out my love <laughs> that one there and a mirror on top now and i think i'll go for the um this one and oh god look at, look at, look with platforms as well and the mirrors just go up into the ceiling If I could eye roll my my face off, I would have eyed I would have done that then. I would have eye rolled my face off. How did they not think these things when they're like making a new feature for the game? Oh, maybe the mirrors won't work, you know? No? Don't want to? Okay. <laughs> right, enough complaining, Aiden. You've complained enough today. No more complaining. Maybe some flowers in here garish bunch of flowers that one of the Karens got her maybe yeah let's do that dry flowers oh it would oh I like that though that's pretty oh that does look nice in here we'll do that we'll do that we'll give her some nice flowers and maybe like a little makeup um tray up here as well which I always struggle to find too we'll do perfumes instead do some base game perfumes Ah, oh, stunning. Stunning. And I think uh, to finish off in here, I'm going to add some pictures around. Um, I wish we had some really garish pictures as well, to be honest with you. Well, we have. We've got lots of them, but like with like kittens and stuff, you know, I would imagine that for Karen. Oh, maybe we could do this in here. For maybe some of Raphael's family and things. Yeah, I would imagine they all live back in Mexico as well. And he tries to visit them as much as he can. Yeah, I like that idea. We're going to shuffle you along still, though, and put you up that high. Yeah, we'll do that. Those there. Um, and maybe one of those tapestries here. Well, not tapestries, but the ones from City Living would look nice in here. Like these numbers. Let me see that one. Mm, I need something a bit more. Yeah, like that. That's nice. Yes. Yeah, and I think a rug. I think the one thing that we need to pull in here is a rug. And I need to get another brighter colour because this bed is popping out quite a bit because everyone else is a little bit more neutral. 
So I'm going to find a really nice rug. There we go. I think that rug is going to suffice. Um, it's got the colours of this room in there mixed up. And I quite am enjoy it. It's from Get Famous, by the way. Never seen that rug in my life. <laughs> the rugs, there's so many swatches for them. I just forget. The best way to look for rugs is to do it by colour swatch. Because you'll pull up ones that you um, either forgot about or have never seen before. I mean, do you remember this? Let me get rid of this. I, I used these rugs to death. Where are you? These. My God, I loved that rug back in the day. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Awful. That's all I can say to that. Yeah, bedroom done. I think to finish off today, we'll do their bathroom. We'll do their ensuite. I'm going to put a blind up in here as well. Uh, size you down, darling. Oh God, it's cutting into the wall. Of course it is. But we're going to forgive it and just let it be. Um, I would love to get a bath and a shower in here. And we've got definitely enough room. So... What kind of bath would I see in here? Um, I think this one. This one from Seasons work, work, works well. Yeah, we'll go a bit more neutral in the bathroom as well with things. Um, I'm going to put... I can move this along now, which will give me a, a little bit more room on this side. Can I do move you along a little bit further? I think I can. If I can just move you into there, like so. Is that squashed? No, that's fine. Put the door there. We'll open it from that way too. And then here, I'm going to put a shower. I'm just going to do a wet room shower as well. Maybe use the, uh, yeah, this one. There we go. Wet room shower there. And I think I can put a toilet and a basin here. So I'll do the basin here and then a toilet here. Because then they'll be able to get in the bath quite easily. So I think I'll use the season's toilet. Because it will match in with the bath okay. Um, Yeah, that's fine. That is fine. I will chuck it into the water. Oh, no, I won't because there's a platform there. Um, oh, I hate you. That should be okay. Let me try and get a, just a nice basin in as well. That took me ages to get that word out. Okay, we changed the orientation a little bit. It was just not working. It's not flowing okay with me. I'm not really sure... Yeah, no, that looks fine. It just looks weird from that side. I've put those um, cedar panels up from Snowy Escape. And I've used this. I think this just looks okay with the actual bathroom itself. Um, I forget where that sinks from. I never use it because I don't really like it. But Eco living lifestyle. Uh, I'm going to do some of those bamboo looking mats here, I think. We'll use them in that tone. Stunning. Um, a little sh a little towel moment here. I think we'll use this rack here as well. We'll do it in a dark wood. Can I? I know we'll do it in a white. That's better. Do it in a white there for the bath. And I think having those... I'm using this object death at the minute, but I love those little like shower gel moments. Sink. Yeah, we just need a toilet roll. Thingy my bob. Holder, whatever you call it. Um... This is a bit of a tight squeeze. Can I put it there? Yeah, I'm going to... Oh, that would get wet from the shower. Oh, wow, well, it's The Sims. Pretend it doesn't. Pretend this has got a screen against it so that it's got glass in the middle. It's got glass. They should be able to use this. Obviously, I will play a test everything before I put it up in the gallery. But, um, yeah, I think that's a pretty okay bathroom. I think what I'm going to do, though, is change the colour of these to the lighter. That's better. Let's change them. Is that flickering too much there? No, that's okay. Yeah, no, that'd be fine. I should swap them around the other way, actually. I think I'll do that. I'll swap these around the other way. So that's on the shower side. Um, But yeah. Cracking on, my loves. Um, So that's what we've done today. We've done the living area. We've done the living area. Or Karen's nosing room. We've also done the little main entrance bit too. Lovely. And we've done their bedroom, which is a little bit of a splash of colour. Something needs to go here now. I might pop a plant there quickly, actually. Um, just a nice generic, like, oh, a cactus. Yes. Not you, though. Yeah, you. That would look nice in the corner there. Oh, perfect. Perfect. So, yeah. So, next week, what we'll do is finishing off everything else. We'll do all of the bathrooms, do all the hallways. Um, Raphael's office as well, the spare bedrooms, 
and this toilet over here too and just put some finishing touches and stuff around but um this build is definitely coming along oh god i'm gonna be getting my reshade on for next week as well maybe i shouldn't put, use my reshade for building <laughs> main reasons being they're not equal um main reasons being i kind of need to have the default colors so you so I know what you guys are getting when you're downloading it. Because <laughs> you could get something and be like, oh my god, I wouldn't have done that. So maybe I'll do it down that route instead. There we go, my darlings. Thank you so much for watching today. I really, really appreciate you. Um, I hope you have a lovely weekend. I will make sure to get a community post up th this weekend or the beginning of next week. It'll probably be this weekend at some point. Um, with the hashtag for the kind of renovation series that I want to start with your builds. I'm definitely going to try and bring one of those out next week as well. And also, I have a shell challenge coming up too. So, I will probably... That won't be next week. I'll link that into um, the week after, I think. So, just keep an eye out for that as well. But yeah, thank you so much for your support. Hello to all you lovely new people that are watching the channel. I appreciate you. I'll be live on Twitch tonight. I'm playing some Assassin's Creed uh, Valhalla you want to come along 7 p.m gmt if not i will see you all on monday goodbye